Hey guys, Tiffany here, and today I am super excited to share with you this treatment that has literally changed my hair game. And for my last video, you know that I've been struggling with my hair for a while, and if you did watch that video and you left a comment or you gave me advice, I am really, really so thankful to you guys for doing that. So since then, my hair has been feeling stronger and healthier, <laughs> and I just know that it's because of this hair treatment. Comment down below if you have a favorite hair treatment or if you've tried this particular treatment. So let's get into it. You're going to need a medium sized onion that you're either going to boil or blend, peppermint oil or another essential oil of your choice, a small bowl, an applicator bottle, and a funnel to make the process a lot easier. So for the foil method, you're going to go ahead and chop the onion into large pieces. And then you're going to add them to the bowl. And you're going to cover that with a lid to make sure that all of that onion goodness just stays in there and marinates. <laughs> Next you're going to bring a cup of water to boil and add that to the bowl. Just enough to cover those onions. And you're going to add a few drops of peppermint oil to the mixture and this is just going to combat that strong onion smell. And once that's mixed in, you are going to go ahead and put the lid back on the bowl Sit it for about 15 minutes. After 15 minutes, we're going to use that funnel to help pour the mixture into the applicator bottle. I have to warn you though that once you lift that lid, the scent is going to be super strong and potent. So I still felt like I could get a lot more juice from the onions, so I just threw all the onion pieces into my blender and I blended everything into a thick pulp. So I'm using the funnel again and this time I'm also using a strainer to extract all of the juice. I put the strainer on top of the funnel while it was in the applicator bottle and I just used a wooden spoon to press into the mixture gently and extract the juice. The strainer is really important because it prevents those onion bits from getting into the mixture and into your hair. Now you can use either one of these methods, but I just preferred to combine the two because I felt like I got more out of the onions. So I'm applying this on dry hair, and as you can see, I still have some heat damage curls that I'm going to be trimming over time. So I'm applying the mixture to my roots, and then I'm just giving myself a very gentle scalp massage. I'd highly recommend having a towel on hand or a t-shirt because um, if you're not doing this in the shower it can get kind of messy. So I just let that sit under two plastic caps for about half an hour and it's completely up to you but I did not sit under a hydro dryer or leave it on for longer because that onion smell would have been a lot stronger. I recommend that you do this before shampooing and conditioning. You may even want to shampoo your hair twice because you don't want to walk around with your hair smelling like onion. guys, I really, really love this treatment. It's natural, it's easy to make, and because of it, I feel like my hair is making a comeback in the space of two weeks, which is amazing. So make sure to check out the description box because I'm going to leave tons of information about this onion juice treatment and also what to expect if you're going to try it. 
and if you do try it out I would love to know so make sure to leave a comment down below. So guys, thank you so much for watching. Make sure to share and like this video if you thought it was helpful. And I will see you soon. Bye.